All right, welcome back to the channel. This video is gonna be a shed hunting trip. Me and Easton made it out to the spot that we've gone out years past. We've found some good sheds out here before. Um, this whole trip so far and probably the rest of the trip is going to be extremely windy, so don't expect me to be talking to the camera at all because um, it's not gonna sound good. Yesterday, got out here, I found one. I'll show you that footage now. Oh my god! <laughs> Three point! Let's go! Yeah, if we would have came here two years ago, it would have been a brown. For real. Dude. That's pretty dope. That's a really good sign. That's a really good sign. I love threes. They're so nice to look at. There it is. First antler of the trip. Old chalky three point with just a little bit of an eye guard. I don't know if you guys can hear me with this wind, but. East and I are out here, the same shed spot. We've gone here a couple times before and have had really good success before, but uh, we've literally been hiking for less than a mile. We've got one down already. So today we're going out to a different, uh, to a spot in this area we haven't quite fully hit yet. So hopefully that pans out and if not, we're going to go to a different part of this mountain range. But anyways, yesterday was a good day. We saw an antelope, two snakes, bunch of jackrabbits, found one antler, uh, no deer, but uh, yeah, we're just going hit to it, hit it again and hopefully today, we got today, tomorrow, and then we leave Monday. And yeah, that's about it. So y'all stay tuned for the rest of this video and the rest of the trip gonna be pretty fun. Let's go. Well, this day was not very eventful. Uh, we ended up hiking a lot further than we planned on. We got out there kind of late, you know, like 11.30 noon when we started hiking. We only were going to do a short hike and then try and go over to a new spot. But we ended up uh, hiking another 8 miles. It was just done. It was like 7.8 or something. 7.9, I think. Uh, so we did a big hike. Super steep country and uh, basically the area we wanted to get to was kind of landlocked with uh, private property. So we had to, we were trying to go way around it and it was just a, a big mess, but we, only thing we really saw were a bunch of lizards and a snake. And uh, yeah, so this antler that I found the first day, I swear there's the one antler that, uh, we had found a set off of that was a year later than one of the antlers I had found out here off the same buck. So this honestly looks very, very similar. So it might be like, it might be the same buck, if not very, very similar genetics. So that'd be kind of cool to, uh, to pair up when we get home. But um, yeah, so that's today. We're gonna cook up some food and crash. It's almost dark out here so talk to you guys tomorrow all right so we ended up leaving the next morning after that weather got bad plans changed you know home the next day so i didn't want to leave this video out just because it's going to be short but it was definitely a shorter video so hopefully you get on to more shed hunting this spring season um that we actually find some more sheds so that's that thank you guys so much for watching you made it all the way to the end of this video please consider subscribing and i'll see you guys on the next episode of wild one outdoors next video that's coming out should be a carp fishing video so 
stay tuned for that. I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace out.